All right, good evening, good afternoon, good morning, and welcome to the stream. I forgot to start the word on stream game. Hashtag pro streamer, not. You know, I think someone that's been doing this for uh, almost eight years would be able to get a process down, but I can't. So, you know, maybe next year. All right, let's check audio here, make sure. Hang on a sec, my uh, screens are a little kinky here. That's a word I'm using. And I want to check the audio to make sure I'm sounding good. Sounds okay. All right, let's uh, switch over to this. And uh, I'm wondering if I'm going to finish. I thought I was going to finish the main story arc uh, on Friday, but I did not. So um, I feel I'm close. There's going to be a, some sort of a big conflict, I think. All right. So, uh, oh, I did some shipbuilding. It, it's, you know, getting the tips I got from car toys and chat and in discord, it's actually a little bit, a, a little difficult until you get used. Whoa, what is that? Big station. Um, it's a little difficult until you get a couple of pointers and then it's not so bad. So I, um, I have a class B ship now with better shields. I think better weapons, at least they're class B weapons. Adequate storage now versus always having to sell stuff that I don't really want to sell. And uh, that should work. What happens is I usually take these out into the garage and I have a garage pair of these. So these end up getting dirty from the garage. So anyways, um, so what I want to do is I have two constellation missions return to the lodge which i don't want to do yet i want to do this but i want to go back to new atlantis and rearm just in case top of the morning to you mr round player <laughs> hey that's that is uh red munchkin gaming there for you thank you red appreciate that and uh um you know, hang on a sec here. Let me. What I'm gonna do. All right, so that worked, but I haven't made any changes. I don't think. Um, actions, welcome. All right, so. We'll see what happens when someone else comes in. If it gets starts giving us a shout out to everyone, which I think was what it was originally intended for, but I think because there's been some changes maybe in the Twitch API and the new version of StreamerBot, I don't know. We'll find out when someone else says something. Um, all right, so I'm back, yay. So actually let me do that. But that did exactly as it should have done. So it, it noticed you said something. It noticed that you're a streamer and that you're a rocket jockey and it gave you a rocket jockey shout out. So that, that's what it should have done. All right. Uh, how's my inventory? It's very low, which is nice. Um, I have two packs. Why do I have two packs? Ooh. Look at the little tiny thing. No, I'm selling that. All right. No, it, it never did that. But when somebody else comes into the chat, it could be like Smitty. They'll give Smitty a shout out, even though he may not stream. All right. So let's sell that. Um, okay. It looks good. So. What I need to do is see this weapon. I have ammo. That weapon is okay. I need more of 11 millimeters. So let's go see if I can find some 11 millimeter, some copper and lead, I think. Ah. 
Encore. Thanks for the test, Red. If you don't see what you want, feel free. If it belongs on your ship, oh, please take a look. All right, ammo. 11 millimeter. Take it all. Wow, that's a lot. And, um,. What do you got for resources? Whoa. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, you don't have any ships. Barn. Dang. You have copper. I'll take all your copper. Um, funny, funny. DE was having the same issue this morning. A shout out for you. A shout out. Everyone gets a shout out. Need some lead. Um, Oh, take that. Oh, there's your ship parts. Okay. Mid pack. I found the guy in the shop on Mars to be very good. I haven't done any shopping Thanks on Mars. Thanks for shopping at Jemison Mercantile. Uh oh, I almost ran into something. Um, there is actually, so let's see here. We got more ammo. I would like more. Cause I go through that quite a bit. Oh, 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 right, right. Down here, if you go to the well, There's a surplus guy right there. I'm telling you, Bianchi, something's wrong with the boots you sold me. Ah. I wear them to the metro. Suddenly, the shuttle runs late. I buy a cup of coffee, and the barista screws up. Well, my I order. actually, I have a mission. It's like I'm I don't want to spoil anything, but I was giving a mission to go to Luna. Uh, so, what do you want me to do about it? Oh. I want a damn refund. Fine, fine. I'll take the boots back. Just don't pay anyone who bought them from here. All this. Ugh, again with at least bigger dime. I got all day. All right, so. MO. Ooh. And oh wait, I think I bought the wrong stuff. Dang it! Hang on. Hang on. Hey, take it easy. Yeah, thanks. So. Uh, all right, so that needs caseless shells. That needs eleven millimeter. And. Caseless shells. Oh, they both require caseless. Oh, okay. That's why I go through them so fast. All right. Personally, I think they absolutely. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm in a, I'm, I'm in a hurry. That says, huh, huh. All right, here we go. All right. You have a nice day. Watch your back out yeah, there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Watching my back. Pardon me. All right. Let's, um... The boots that were made for walking. Oh. I know, I know. I... I with this particular character, I'm, I'm primarily focusing on what I have and the main storyline. But I want to go do this quest that I got. And I don't want to spoil anything. I met two very interesting individuals. And, uh, no, this is my first tune. Nice my second now. tune, I played a little bit and got them up to the point to where I go to the lodge for the first time. And that one's going to, whoa, that one will be uh, Freestar. 
uh, faction. All right, so let's go here. Probably should have just fast traveled. Hey. No, I don't want it. You're gonna give me something weird. Uh, okay, so first of all, can I do any research? Yeah, one faction per tune. Yeah, this one was Constellation and UC. Because you, you kind of have to do Constellation. Not all of it, but most of it, I guess. Yeah, I, I, I'm not very awe inspired about the uh, New Game Plus thing. You know, may, maybe I, I'll, I'll try it. Okay. Need something? Uh, no. All right, let's go here. Do this. And my inventory resources, resources, and then we want to transfer. Now, when I do that, okay, here's the ship's parts I'm carrying around. There we go. All right, now let's see here. Once again, plenty of ammo there, a little light there, 355, 384. So my drum uses 11 millimeter. And then that uses M.45 MI. I'm currently a wanted bounty hunter who's a crimson pirate. Nice. Uh, so, wait a minute, what am I looking for? Dot 43 MI. That military grade? There it is. I can make six. Confirmed. Nice. Oh, that's nice. All right, then that is caseless shells. Oops. Caseless huh. Oh there it is. No, that's seven seven caseless. I don't know which one it is. Eleven millimeter caseless. Interesting. I'm funny walking around with the points of interest that have been taken over by pirates. They let me just walk around and I just drop them. Oh, there you go. There, yeah, yeah. I don't see. Huh. Did you pick? Maybe I'm missing something here. All right, so. Plenty of ammo there. Okay, there. This uses 11 millimeter. All right, so let's. One. 11. All right, so it's those that I need. Huh. Why can't I make any? Oh. I guess they require four copper, and I don't have. All right, all right. All right, fine, fine, fine. I guess we're, uh. We're about as fit as we can go. So let's get out of here. Now, I hate to say this, there is a mod that spit that speeds up getting in and getting out of the cockpit, accessing and getting out of the workbenches because I do think the animation's cool but after a while, it gets to be a huge inconvenience or it just, it, it's the time. So I've got this, which I'm here for, but I wanna do this one. This one I'm very intrigued upon. Yes, moon. First off, I just wanna travel to the moon first. What is that? I don't know what, okay. Um. So can I, 
Uh, is this soul? This is soul. There's earth. All right, let's let's go there first. And earth. Whoa. Let's take a look. Wow. Um. Um. Huh. Doesn't look normal. Okay, we're going to the moon. And we're going to go here. Same here. What I thought was really cool is I guess there was an original idea. What is that? Nova Galactic Shipyard. All right. Not good. Um, I read an article, Kotaku, or Internet Gaming News, one of those two, where they said that they were considering using the earth from fallout 4 i went ooh i like that idea all right so we're going here landing okay now it's funny i had a mission an unmanned weapons lab and when I landed I saw people walking around it was spacers it's like they didn't realize uh, I was here even though I landed right in front of them all right so investigate the research station Ooh, this sounds like fun actually all right let's uh let's take a gander Don't see anyone walking around. I know I'm supposed to go over there, but what's over here? Absolutely nothing. But before I go directly in, I want to take in all the sites here. So we've got some sort of a Pipeline. This relay station has to be at least a hundred years old. Okay, so it's a relay station. Thanks, Barrett. Hey, Red, being that you're active in chat, I was curious, could you drop me a DM um, in Discord whenever you feel like it, whenever you can? I'm wanting to butt heads with you that if the bot isn't working, I want to see I need, I need to have a study group to work on what may or may not be wrong. Ooh. Frontier attire? Interesting. Evidently I need that. I just wanna see what time, what available time you might have that will overlap my time. And uh, no one in there. As far as I can see. And, and try to surmise what might have gone wrong or maybe it's maybe it's working correctly. I, I just don't remember giving a shout out to every single individual that pops into chat. It never used to do that. Okay, I got a key. I had a key, Barrett. We're okay. I still have a key. If you're not part of the solution, you're part of the precipit. Oh, I get it. You'll catch up. 
Alright. Have an upstairs. The nice window view. I'm gonna take that. I don't need that. Lockers. Okay, let's do the lockers first. No. Moonbase Slate. Voltaire really is something else. A supercomputer so powerful, they put it on the damn moon to keep it cool. Although by that logic, they should be running it purely in the vacuum of space. But hey, good marketing material. Huh. Uh, I've been spending some off hours running some dumb simulations just because I can. My favorite so far is simulating the sound of every duck on Earth quacking after receiving a piece of bread. You didn't know you wanted a real-time sim of feeding all the ducks, but now you have it. <laughs> Welcome, humanity. Did he say ducks? That's weird. Science crate. Okay. Hey. When I accepted the assignment up here, we were told to bring a couple of personal items. Some psychological study said it helps when you're away from Earth this long. I brought my grandmother's old abacus. I would play with it on her lap, and she'd teach me the Russian for all the numbers. She, uh, just got word that she passed. Whoops! The next shuttle isn't for three months, so I, uh, I won't be able to go to the funeral. <sighs> Goodbye, Babushka. Thank you for teaching me math. It brought me to the moon. Nice. All right, so we're gonna try to crack this. I have 22 digi picks. All right, so that one will not work. That one will, so we're gonna use it. Not there. Uh, okay, and then we just need a single. Seems like a waste. All right, um, that one will not work. All right, then we have, oh. Mm. Okay. Still gives me that, which, there we go, all right, that works, so, do I want to do that one? Then we want to do that one. All right. Without a doubt, we want to do that one. Then we have another single, which I have one. Then, okay, that works. And then another single. Ah, okay. Okay, I'm not big on the melee. Bullstring, deep con. Yeah. Okay, I need zero wire. I can sell it. Now, let's see what's in there. All I know is that you would think by the difficulty level, now this goes down there, but I'm assuming this door also goes in there. Um. You would assume that the difficulty level would, 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 you know, novice to master, you'd get more good stuff, but that doesn't seem to be the case. Looks like everybody evacuated fast. Really? Because, okay, maybe. Ooh, did you pick? Ah, uh, another safe. All right, well, maybe. I do realize there's a mission thing right there. Ooh. Oh, that's just outside, okay. It just goes out. All right. 
Oh, wait, there's another door. Let's say. Reminder, run daily diagnostics, record source, record type, record, 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 unprint. All right. Yeah, very random, sir. Very random indeed. Tanning bed. Or sleeping, but whatever. And some chests that were empty yeah i don't like that hey look at there you ever get jealous you know the crew in the shipyard building the actual vessels that are going to travel the stars we're literally on a base on the moon Oh, come on, Sabina. I'm trying to share my dreams here. Well, your dreams are always out there and never here where the rest of us live. Can't you just be happy doing your job? Where's the fun in that? Well, I think I've explored everything except for the ultimate objective here. Not a very big place. But let me let the TV on. Hey. Nova Galactic Project Log, Principal Engineer Lang Shu. Lang Shu. I admit, this is not the most disciplined team I've ever run. <laughs> Malcolm keeps stealing computational time on Voltaire, and thinks I don't know this. And Sabina's been distracted lately, but won't tell anyone why. I really should demand answers from both of them. But honestly, I'm too preoccupied with this contract. We all are. Despite anything going on in our personal lives, there's something special about what we're building here. All right. So, wait a minute. What's that? Oh, I didn't see that one. Nova Galactic Project Log, Principal Engineer Lang Shu. Voltaire is being reconfigured for this new initiative. The math we're being asked to crunch is ambitious, even for a supercomputer. We might as well be asking it to count every grain of sand in every desert on Earth. Who came up with these original equations? I don't know. Our partner isn't being very open about it. Partner. Every question I have goes through some discretionary channel. I'm surprised we even know we're working on a ship. Wait, they're working on a ship? Oh wait, they're working on a ship. I remember that. Okay, never mind. Hmm. All right. Here we go. Oh, evidently, I need that. All right. So, Project Prism launch. Uh, oh. Play the recording on the roof. Sound, sounds like some sort of production. We're happy to announce the first test launch of Project Prism to be held today. I would like everyone to suit up, join us on the roof at 9 p.m. Reminder, please sync all watches for Eastern Daylight Time. Partner, 
will also be on the radio. Interesting. Reminder research team that Voltaire is a highly proprietary supercomputer is not currently being contract exclusive for the use of prison project. It is not to be used for personal projects. Okay. So I'm going to the roof. Is there a way from here to get to the roof? Or do I have to go outside? I have to go outside to get to the roof. All right, fine. I've got a suit. Oh, excuse me. Uh, got an automatic cat feeder over the weekend. He's learning quickly. He was at the bowl before it finished dispensing breakfast. Oh, there you go. It's all about timing. Okay, so I gotta press this button over here. All right. There's that little sad dot. Yes. Engine spin up time almost complete. Total time five minutes, 22 seconds. Ride on schedule. How are the helium three valves holding Nova? We double checked the leakage concerns this morning before the launch. All signs are cool. Any changes to the calculation sequence from Voltaire? No changes since we uploaded the last figures yesterday. It's a clean shot from here to Jupiter. One day the computer will be on board the spaceship. Just imagine that. One miracle of science at a time, Canaveral. Counting down in five, four, three, two, one. Where did it launch from? Canaveral, are you reading? All clear, Nova. Indicators look good. The ship should be cruising Jupiter's orbit right now. Visual confirmation will be possible in... <laughs> 32 minutes. Afraid the speed of light is on the slow side these days. <laughs> How does it feel to break the laws of physics, Canaveral? We're all pretty excited down here in NASA, I won't lie. Excited enough to tell me where you got the original data? Not in a million years, Nova. Go to NASA? No way. I've never been to NASA. We're going to NASA. Wait, oh, we're going to Earth. <gasps> we're going to Earth. I saw an open crate over here. That's it. All right, let's go. Now, what's making me nervous is I, I landed on a planet and there was a nearby landing of a starborn ship and it took me too long to catch up to where the ship was, so I didn't see them get out or anything. So. So, I've upgraded, see? Hey, is this Starfield? It sure is. All right, so do I wanna go? No, I don't think so. All right, so we want to go to NASA. That course for Earth, travel. Um, I'm having a lot of fun with it. Whoa. All right. So there's a lot of similarities from Fallout 4, Skyrim and stuff like that. Um, with this particular playthrough, I'm just doing the main storyline. I also did one of the faction storylines. So there's different factions like in Fallout 4 where you got the Minutemen, you've got the Brotherhood of Steel, the Institute, the Railroad. 
So you have different factions and they have their own storylines. Plus there's side quests and base building and all that kind of stuff. So we're going here, NASA. Here we go. Landing out in the middle of nowhere. This is weird. This NASA has a secret. You know, in Interstellar, NASA was like a, a secret cave. All right, exiting ship. Whoa. All right, so for the record, it seems like for whatever reason, my bot is working. What I mean by that, it's not getting, giving everyone a shout out. The last time it was giving everyone a shout out and I had made no changes to it. Now I did comment out some code that I originally added. So that could be That might be a reason. Maybe they changed something and I wasn't reading the notes very well. Find a way inside, okie dokie. So Red, you've got 110 hours. Hey, I'm curious, how many how many hours do I have in? Steam, library, home. Um, I've got 96.6. So Red's got me beat. You win. So that's the way in up the oh oh this place has been through the ringer. <laughs> well NASA. it's actually NASA. This is one of the towers that got us to safety among the stars. Really? Okay. You say so. <clears throat> well, I tell you what, <clears throat> I do. God, it scared the bejesus out of me. I almost peed. Um, I've been working on a stand for my wood planer. Um, using reclaimed lumber and it has been challenging. It's been a process. And um, over the weekend, we, we nailed down the top to it, which doesn't sound too hard, but I had a problem that with this reclaimed lumber, there was some twists and some bends and stuff like that. So I had to use- I bet that elevator shaft will take us deeper inside NASA. Shut up. I need to work through some rubble. Yeah, yeah, whatever. I'm going up, dude. Um, so I had to use some straps, some ratchet straps to, whoa, to, uh, to bring it in square so I can put the lid on, which I just did over the weekend. And, um, the, um, <laughs> I, I mentioned in, uh, I, my, 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 my skill with a skill saw, I can't cut very straight, but I have acquired a, um, um, basically a track saw. Okay. And I was able to get everything all squared away with that. 
Yeah, this should be interesting. Ah! Uh, 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 uh. Oh, there. Sweet. Now, how would I have actually gotten up here? How terrible it must have been for them to watch others escape. Oh, gotcha. While they realized it was over. Um. I'm in I'm in explore mode right now. So anyways, uh, we've got the top on and because I wasn't making very accurate cuts, I finally got around to making the top square on all corners, but I was like three quarters of an inch with a gap. So with my new acquired track saw, it's basically a Craig AccuCut, which allows you to take any skill saw and make a track saw. Um, so I was able to cut enough material to fill the gap and oh, oh, um, and I glued it over the night in place. I need to do a little bread. Why not open it? Good. So I got to do a little bread nails to secure it. And um, then I'm going to measure several times and cut myself the top piece, which will be some uh, MDF, MFD, M MDF. Micro fiber or something. Yeah, MFD. And then I have to make a bottom shelf and then figure out why it wobbles and find out which leg is short, cut it, put casters on it, and uh, I think we're on our way. So I gotta do some Mario hopping here. I just gotta figure out what I'm gonna miss if I go the wrong way. Oh, oh I thought that was a body. <laughs> Oh, I missed. Oh, can I not do that? All right, I don't know how, I don't, I guess I don't know how to jump there. There's a catwalk. All right. Ugh. Here we go. Oh, could have gone up there, cross. Yeah, I get, I get it, I get it. Okay, broken, a little broken. There's work lights on here, makes me a little nervous. Don't need that. Okay, we're gonna go a little hippity hoppity. Broom. All right, so there's a, up there. So there's lights on. Must be nuclear. Uh, I'm not gonna take the zero Man, wire. It looks like this one almost made it to launch. Almost. I what the final problems were. I don't know. Ooh, did you pick? Oh, a NASA globe. I'm taking that. Notepad. NASA book. Another NASA notebook. Ooh, toy rocket. Okay. An instigating calibrated old earth something or other. Old school pistol. Oh, look at that. All right, so if I go, oh, I should have done this to that and then go to weapons, old. I got more rounds for that. Fire rate's slow, heavier. Yeah, mine's better.
Well, you know what? Um, there's no bodies, so that's a that's a pretty good sign so far. Explorer spacesuit. Yeah. A lot of construction material around Looks here. Like the lift is offline. Yeah, yeah, yeah the lift is power. offline. Let's look around. I'm looking around, dude. Barrett, you're just really slow, aren't you? Like, enter NASA. You know, it's moving. Wicked noises. Oh, emergency power. Oh. All right, hang on. We have a digi pick. A wafer. Calibrated. No, I don't need that. So I'm assuming that um, these energy cells. That's something powering up or something laughing at me. I'm going to take another. I'm going to take this one just in case. Power it full. All right. Well, whoever's here now knows I'm here. Both. All right. We're, uh, you're going to stay there, huh? Okay. Chicken. Launch facility. I have my flashlight on game. All right, so crew preparation area. You think? I can't imagine how tense and chaotic it must have been. So nothing over here. Weird noises. <sighs> There's always clues. Oliver Twist. <laughs> so when I first played um, Fallout 3, I powered through. I didn't check terminals. I didn't pick up notes or scrolls or anything like that. And I missed out on a lot. Oh, I guess I'm going over there. Um, Fallout 4, I was more, I actually started being more diligent in Fallout New Vegas reading the terminals and, and uh, stuff like that. And in Fallout 4, I believe it was at the Mass Fusion building, these inner office menu uh, me uh, memos or emails, there was a group of people playing Dungeons and Dragons. And I either missed a terminal or they on purpose didn't finish the story. So, yeah. All right, guess we're gonna use a computer here. Ooh. All right, so error, archives damage, running system recovery. Station log, Dr. Judith Tatian. The recent delivery from Mars is unsettling. I was expecting rock samples or maybe fossils of microbial life. Instead, Dr. Victor Isa comes with two members of the military. Everything they've brought back is under wraps. What could a theoretical physicist need with a sample from Mars? I don't know. Station log. Dr. Judith Tatian. I have been trying to cause you up to Dr. Isaac, Victor, to see what is going on. His team has completely commandeered one of the labs with those two military hand revs, checking who comes in and out. I joked that maybe he found a little gray man who was doing an autopsy. Huh. And he grew very pale. Oh. Two days later, he sends me a request. Hey, B Mac. All right, so it is giving a shout out to. Science, 
That's Anyone that seems to have okay. screamed or something like that. We have a meeting tomorrow. I... I think I'm being invited into the lab. Alright, so... I think the bot is doing what it needs to do, but the change I made a while back, it doesn't seem to be taking, or something like that. Vision log. Dr. Judith Tatian. I just read that one. I have been vision log. Dr. Judith Tatian. I have never been so nervous since I defended my dissertation. Four hours talking to Victor and his team about theoretical metals, atomic bonding, even a half hour divergence into magnetism that I'm pretty sure was to throw me off the trail of what we were actually talking about. Then I got to see the lab. I, I don't know how much I should say, but the periodic table just got thrown out the window. Oh. So to the best of my knowledge, BMAC, you've never gotten an auto shot out from the bot, but that's been happening for a week now. So I just read all that. Remember the final vitals and suit seal checks are essential. Yes, we've come a long way as far as tolerances. Yes, the number of people cleared for launch is much higher than it used to be, but these people lives are still in our hands. I don't know the rumors. The next launch is slated this canceled. All right, so interesting. Yeah. So the bot's working, but it's doing something it was intended for, but I had made some changes so it wouldn't give a shout out to every everyone that has ever tried to stream or or uh-oh. So that's one step in the right. This ain't NASA. Alright. Oh. Uh okay, maybe I have to go down. Oh. I have to go down. It's a complex. It looks like a structural collapse of the underlying strata. Yeah. Typical of karst topography. That's what I. That's what I was thinking too, Barrett. Exactly what I was thinking. Did they? Uh, did they materialize this base? No, I. I think it just it was a collapse. Oh, 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 oh. They had a museum, but this whole place is a museum now. <laughs> anyway, looks like an exit at the end of the hall. Oh, look at that. That that's the uh that's a Soyuz. Um What was that called? The STAP or something like that? That's when um that's when a a um an Apollo and a Soyuz docked. Gene Cerna was part of the team, if I remember correctly. I don't know what I'm talking about. All right, there's a rocket engine for, uh... oh, the F1 engine. Oh yeah, yeah, cool, very cool. Big engine, a lot of power. And this is something new. In 2150, scientists were first predicted the destruction of our beloved Earth atmospheric phenomenon would cause breathable air to sputter outside the Earth's gravity, dooming all that remained estimated 50 years until the end has given NASA has given NASA and other space engineers around the world opportunity to migrate humanity away from the Earth. Oh, all right, so Earth is unlivable. Bummer. I'm going over there in a sec. I'm, I'm, I'm taking a look at some pretty. So that's ISS. What's left of it? Okay, I, I was already here. Okay, let's go upstairs. Old computers. Be down there in a sec. This is how they slept. 
I'm taking the trauma pack. Rock. Uh, nothing. Closed for remodeling. Okay. Yeah, so that's the, the sort of representation of the International Space Station. Oh God. Right, let's see what we got over here. Computer, waving, landing on Mars or something like that. That is a, is that the Gemini? Oh, Mercury, adaptive design intended for high altitude, the Mercury spacesuit. But it go several modifications deal with the pressure of oxygen, thermal considerations. Unstable station, nice fashion pose. <laughs> yes. All right. Yes. And this would be um, Mercury, right? Six flights total were launched. Very nice. Then, of course, we have the uh, Apollo. Apollo 11's flight. Nice. Okay. Spacesuit, helmet, Mercury pack. Hazard protection and medic. Wow. Uh, yeah, I'm back on Earth. Yeah, I went to Luna. I went to Luna. Leaving Earth forever. We just read that. I just read that. Oh, I just shot it too. I didn't mean to. Sorry. All right. I don't need zero wire. Old Earth pistol again. Makes sense, because I'm on Earth. Explore, skip pack. Nah. Hey! It's, um, um. Mars Explorer Rover. Look for the Opportunity Rover on Mars. Oh, cool, I will. Nice. Cool. <laughs> uh, did apes take over? I have not come across any sort of uh, simians or banana peels yet. So here we have the lunar excursion module. Actually, they, they stopped calling it excursion because it made it sound like they're going on a uh, holiday no can't get in darn it Ooh, what's this this is project prism oh nasa partnered with nova galactic the creators of the voltaire supercomputer so this is what launched to jupiter oh i need to read it the first successful voyage saw astronauts reaching jupiter in the moments of what would have been taken years oh okay what's uh it's got some radiator panels, some sort of interstellar engine. I'll get to that in a minute. Do each one of these say the same thing? Yeah, okay. Um, I don't think that's weapons. I think it's reverse thruster. So we have the living outside earth, long-term missions in space, late 1990s, which programs international space station humanity began living on other planets almost one year, 100 years later. Small outposts of five were scientific research teams eventually gave way to entire colonies. Neat. Judith. I just don't understand where these calculations came from. There's something wrong with the math? I think it's quite straightforward. That's not what I'm asking. We've had no success extracting even a sample of material from the object. No explanation for the gravitational effects. No motion graph to explain its harmonic frequencies. I can't even establish a melting point. Judith. But you've had me building these prototype colliders for months. And now you want me to bump helium-3 into it based on this equation you've written on a goddamn napkin? I just need you to trust me. I have been trusting you. We keep slamming our heads against a brick wall, getting nothing. And you keep 
are coming up with something new to try. Like, you know what's going to happen. Where are you getting your information, Victor? I'm sorry, Judith. I... Look, not here, okay? Somewhere off base. I'll tell you everything. But I'm not lying, okay? We're going to discover something important here. I promise. He's been privy of some very interesting information. And he's trying to bluff his way through. Or something along those lines. Toilet paper. All right. In rooms like this across the globe, scientists figured out how to save our species. These are the heroes. So before it was all collapsed. Okay. Because if they built rooms like this, that's probably why there were some problems. Uh, okay. Can't go that way. Oh, wait. No, can't go that way or that. Okay, so we've got to go this way. That's the Earth the um a special sort of hell for hopeful scientists. Yeah, okay. That's the uh um curiosity or yeah, the head for it. Something. Beryllium. Take it. This is uh ooh, research lab. Is there anything new on it? Nope. 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 And no. All right. I supposed to get over there oh no oh i see i got it i got it i got it i got it you know whenever i see toilet paper on one of these cards i think about that scene from uh ghostbusters 2 or Ghostbusters, excuse me, when that, when the cleaning lady comes out and they blast her. Can't seem to open those. All right, can I open this? Oh, all right, let's check it out. Um, all right, let's use this one up, which means I need two. Will that work? No, I need too close. That will not work. Hmm. I can't use, if I use that for, I can't do, oh wait. That would work. All right, so we'll do that one, do that one. All right, now. They're very specific. So then we have one, two, three. All right, so if I try to use this one, I've got that, that, that. Three spaced out like that, maybe. Maybe? Oops. No.
Yes. I had it. Okay, so that one and that one. All right. Good eye, good eye. I thought it was off by one. All right. Thanks, BMAC. Okay. That would work there. Then we need... Oh, wait. This one would work. Wait, would those work together? Look at that. Perfect. Oh, yeah, thanks. No. Oh. Advanced. No. 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 Yes. <laughs> All right, that was not even really worth it. So I would imagine I couldn't do this because it needed power. I'd have to run all the way upstairs. Whoa. Okay, I'm just turning on switches. Because I can. I thought this said molecular Steve. Who's Steve and why is he molecular? Red is bad. Oh, that's an exit sign. I know. What I was commenting on. Oh, okay. We're all molecular. It's true. Did I? Oh. Okay. Oh, I'm never getting back. Oh, jeez. You know, if you notice this right here, what? See with the gun thing? Watch. Hang on. That was a mod in Fallout 4. Spelunking in NASA. So, it can't go that way. There's uh, something in that. Oh. Oh. Uh, okay. Um. Whatever. Try later. Oh, wait a minute. Do I want to? What's in there? All right. Oh, wait. What's down here? Oh, I guess I could have gotten down here. I'll take that. I got I got itch. I got itch. Use the mining laser. Okay. I'll give that a shot. I got one of those. I don't know how many of these I might need. Probably just the one. All right. Let's try... I have a mining laser. No, not there. Oh, look at that. Nice idea. Because when I think about stuff like that, somebody always comes back and says, you give Bethesda too much credit. I went, okay, ooh, okay. I said, all right, well then. There you go. All right, so I was already down here. Let's end up, at least I did that right. Pamphlet. <laughs> Drawing a dining fork. It's not just a fork, it's a dining fork. Wow, those are some old NASA computers there. Go. Somebody's laughing at me. No. Okay. It's nice that they have a water receptacle here right next to the door because you never know. Did you pick? Broken window. I didn't do it. Oh. Okay. Uh. 
Ooh, you're there. Which led to absolutely nowhere. <laughs> Hang on a sec, guys. Alex was checking in with me about something we were working on. So I went in there, that goes to places, that doesn't go anywhere. So this is the obvious route. Fiber, don't need it. I have plenty of zero wire, so I really don't want to pick up any more. I haven't figured out a way how to take certain things off my tracking list. See like all or none. Okay. Hey! All right, all right. What is it? Do we have turrets? Heck is shooting. We have turrets. All right. Zero. Oh, dude. Hang on, I gotta reload. Robot down. Oh, there's another robot right there being built. It almost looks like Vosco. I'm guessing that terminal way over there turns off the... Uh... Ouch. Oh, dear Lord. All right, so my bot is giving a shout out to anyone that's ever tried to stream and is following. So I'll have to uh, just deal with that for right now. All yours. Thank you. And uh, I'll try to fix that later. Okay, let's just um, make sure we're not missing anything over here. We've got rooms. I don't want the zero wire. We got too much of it. Control rods, explosive tanks. Well, look at that. What? Vasco definitely takes after this side of the. Oh family. yeah, 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 yeah. I know. That's what I was saying earlier, Barrett. You know, I just don't talk to myself here, Barrett. I'm talking for uh, a reason. Dude, yes. Okay, so I see something over there, but there's stuff over here. Okay. Oh, Primony. I didn't know that actually, it wasn't lit up. So I didn't know I could do that. Okay. Oh, dang, dang it, I wasted it. Nope, nope, nope. Uh, there we go. No, uh oh, I'm in trouble, ain't I? I'm not in trouble. There we go. Nothing wrong with those shout outs unless you don't want it. It's yeah, it's distracting in chat. Um, the, the gentleman that wrote the script helped me fine tune it. And for some reason it went bonkers about a week ago. Ooh, tunnel, of course. All right, let's see here. Ah. Uh, 
All right, so I can't use that. I can use this. Okay, so this would work not there, not there. Okay, that would work there. Then we need it that one. Okay. Wait, that. Which one was that one? Okay, that one, and then this one. And then I didn't look this far ahead. So we could use either one of these. That one seems a little bit more particular. So then we need a three. Okay, so maybe. That works. Then I need two close together. Then one over here, which I don't have. Hmm. I don't think I um, did this one right. All right. So on a slot, I, that means I have one, right? So that seemed pretty logical to me. Then I have three possibilities here. That one works. This one's really obscure. So I want to use the obscure one, but that leaves, I don't have, I have that. So if I use this and then that, that leaves that wrong, I think. So if I do an auto slot, See, I can't, that's what I thought. And that's gonna leave me with a single that I don't have. Yeah, see, I'm, so I, I don't, oh no. Oh geez, I didn't mean to do that. All right, I guess I have 21 digipicks. So I can just keep going, I guess. I run out, all right, that works. Leaving those. So we'll do that. This. Oh, I know that one. There we go. All right. Now that one works for there leaving. See, I can figure this stuff out. The other one I, I could not figure out. So I'm, I'm not a whole idiot. I'm just kind of a half hit idiot. No signal. All that for no signal because I killed them all. That's just great. That's just great. There's no fire extinguisher there. All right. Oh, oh okay, cool. All right, hang on. Have I exploited? I'm sorry. Have I explored everything? why there was turrets and a robot and a big door oh, what am i doing again i forgot what am i doing i am trying to find out the first grab drive was developed to help nasa on earth help find out how this was connected to the artifact okay okay door and a down all right let's check out the door somebody's uh office i think or a storeroom perhaps circuit board notebook sealant that doesn't work. 
Alright. Dude, turn your flashlight off. Uh. They don't. Something at the. Something. Something. Need more robust notes. This is a good spot to write a bunch of science stuff. <laughs> if lid needs to be thicker, if or hit something hinges. Uh, okay. Weird. Sounds like a whiteboard from Big Bang Theory. Although, from what I understand, Big Bang Theory's whiteboards were always accurate. Imagine if they hadn't been able to convince people to invest this much. I wonder if humanity would still be here. Uh, ouch. Oh, I, I don't know. Do you think they mind that I'm looting as I'm investigating? He's not going to answer. Whoa. Whoa. I mean, all I can say is, whoa. The artifact isn't far. Now, what? But what? look at all this stuff. Simply and astounding. I know. That's why I'm checking it out, dude. And this one's locked, and I see a big box in there. So, and something to cut with a wall or something. I don't know what I'm talking about. So, I can't use the big ones. I have to use little ones again. Oh, wait. No, okay, still. That's almost the same. Ah. <sighs> Okay. That was unfortunate. Oh. Um, that's right, so that one. And then, uh, <gasps> I don't have a single. No, that won't work. So I have to use a couple of twos. No. E okay, so that works there. Man. Wait, how does this work? This one does not lock. Oh, it locks in there. All right, so. Hmm. Nope. Hmm. Um, so I'm not too sure what auto slot means. If I do it, nothing happens because I can't auto slot in. So I really want to go in here. I think I did something wrong at this level. I picked that one, which was probably the wrong choice. And that leaves a twofer. Like that one. All right, so we'll do that. That. Then we're down to this. All right, so, which I think is the same predicament I was in before. I'm doing something wrong here. Well, I went all the way back, so.
Too late. Sorry. I went back already. All right, so this is where I start getting a little jammed up here. So I can use this one, which will leave a single, which I have a single. And I'm, I'm back to the same one. Okay, so, so do that one and this one? No. Yeah, now I don't have the single. All right. Now I've got the single. That would force me to use a single. If I use this one, I have that to use, right? Three and two, all right. Oh, no, 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 dang it. What happened? I'm, I'm blowing it here. Hang on. All right. All right. So that gives me the single. I, I, do, I don't want to use the single here, do I? I want to use that one and then that one. Yeah. All right. This one and then that one. And then see, this is where I get lost. Oh, I see. I see. I see. Okay. All right. All right. Got it. Yeah. I'm, I'm... That didn't take long at all. It took a lot longer than you'd think. Thanks, man. Okay. We got a safe and this thing. Something probably really nasty behind this. We'll find out. Three hundred. Hey, look at three that. Clock got. Hey, Chris, man, thank you so much for the twenty-five months. More than two years and starting on year three. Yes, you are. Thank you, Chris. Dude, turn off your flashlight. It's not me, is it? No, it's him. All right, whatever. All right, so we have. Oh, geez. Wait. Oh, look what I did. Do I, do I want to be in here? That looks very dangerous and important. Oh, I've, I've released anti-gravity or something. There's a door down there. All right, hang on. This is a, a research state. Yeah, that's not going to help me at all. Fiber's not going to help me. <laughs> all right, let's um, let's go back up. Well, I was feeling that I wasn't. Oh, there's a vent too. Interesting. Oh, geez. I'm, I'm hung up on girders. I got it. All right. Now, if I go, oh, okay. So I blew it for the rest of the base. Great. Oh. I need two. That, that. And I need a one, which I don't have. So if we do these guys, then that one. Okay. We 
Count of Monte Cristo, a book. Huh. That's interesting. Long barrel, laser sight, tactical grip, large magazine. The Count Monte Cristo. Not the, not the con, no. Um, all right, I'm going to give this new weapon a, uh, a, yeah. Yes, very good prison break, exactly. All right, well, now I did it. Oh, now I'm walking. Hey, I'm walking. <laughs> hey, I'm walking. Oh, now I'm flying again. Oh, jeez. Uh, oh, bodies. Okay, now I'm starting to get a little lost. All right, so hang on, hang on. Um, all right, that's that room. And there's apps. Okay, so this is just another way to go. Okay, got it. All right. Okay, we're gonna do do that in a sec. I just want to make sure I'm not missing out on anything in here. Oh, okay. No, no. Up, 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 up. Down, down, down. Over. Okay. All right. Um, and then there's this that I could have opened up from here to get to here. Okay, so let's see what this got to say, finally. I think I explored too much. Access station logs, air. Project log, Dr. Victor Isa. We turned on the prototype today. The gravitational field around it began to fold as we long suspected. Complete reversal of gravitational pull was observed on dozens of loose Complete objects around the reversal. lab. I'm setting up a meeting with the directors to propose a larger test. The prototype proves we don't need the original anymore. But further work is going to have to take place in space. Somewhere with abundant helium-3 and with a civilian partner. Someone with access to large-scale manufacturing resources and computational equipment. Engineering gravitational folds pulling the far side of the solar system closer to us. It's all going to be possible. All right, all right, all right. Guys, I need a bio break. So 10, 15 minute break here. And um, let's do this. No, let's do that. I got to read the other one. Oh, hang on. There we go. So I'll get this going and uh, I'll be back very soon. All right, so don't go anywhere. I'll be back.
Alrighty, I'm back. All right, let's uh, let's get back to this. Let's do this. Not do that. Hang on. That. 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 Do that. Do that. All right, and we're back. All right, so I was reading terminal. Um. Project log. Doctor Victor Isa. Already read that. Project log. Doctor Judith Tatian. I watched the Gravja tests from the moon today. It was the first time we were able to talk to the team at Nova Galactic directly. So many things were under wraps before, but now everyone wants all the publicity they can get. Huh. I'm already seeing proposals for manufacturing androids of drives, expeditions to Alpha Centauri and beyond. It's also overwhelming and worrying. It could take years. Decades before we know what all these side effects of operating a crab to life can be. But no one wants to hear that right now. Like a bunch of pioneers racing towards the edges of the frontier without knowing about the grizzly bears in the mountains. Alright. Security procedures. Check all bad. Okay, right. So... Um, all right, so they all lead the same way. I went into that room, right? And then I would have checked all these and loaded around. And I think they all go to the same place eventually. There might be some, ah. Uh, like this, which is something I don't need. This is great. All right. Door, Ooh, another door. Cannot open that door, emergency access. All right, there. Trying to be a little methodical about not missing something kind of important here. All these levels have got doors. And these are just like access hallways to the pipe area, which is interesting. In the Navy, they had all these compartments here called fan rooms. There was no fans, there was just pipes. <laughs> so, all right. So, oh, okay. Then we're floating all right so we're just gonna then we already know where that goes and then see this room which is locked all right hang on it's gonna be one of these all right so let's see here nope that so we need a another three fur no that one won't work One, two, three. Well, none of the fours work. We could do a two, maybe. That leaves one, two, three, four, which I don't have a four that fits that. <laughs> All right. That one won't work. This one works there. No, oh, can't use that one there. Hey, what do you know? I did I had to get a cheat. Huh. Are you serious? Just a 
hallway. Well, maybe it'll help out later. I, I don't know. Ooh. Oh, geez. Wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait. Before I go in there, how important do you think it is that I go down, check out this, this poor son of a gun? Oh. He's got a NASA maintenance key. That's important. And chlorine. Because he was washing something. Oh, oh dude. Door. Ooh, that looks important. I'm just opening up all the doors, which means something could come out. I can't get in there. It says emergency access. This looks like I shouldn't be in here. Ooh, what about in here? Expert, I've got it. Only got six digi picks. I, you know, this place is not giving me a whole lot of great stuff. I saw it. Okay. All right. I saw a mod that takes the um, the mini game and simplifies it. Now, yes, it's a cheat, and I use something very similar in Fallout 4. That if I had the skill to crack the code, it would make it easier. That way. You guys don't go through the painful process of me trying to figure out something that seems so obvious to you guys, but not to me. Okay, I think I have not been here. Loading Z wire. Just trying to see. Oh. All right. Okay. Is this the supercomputer they were talking about, or maybe? Ooh. All right, let's, um, okay, we have a maintenance key again, med pack, dude. Well, they don't need it now. Release artifact. What? Uh, error, okay. I never actually got to visit your labs back when we were working on the grab drive projects. Seems like ancient history now. Only thing we're doing these days is launching weather satellites. Guess this is as good a retirement as any. Huh. Now, Project Demeter, you want our help manufacturing scanners to better track these new meteorological patterns we've seen. Our guess is that the poles might be naturally shifting, causing some gravitational fluctuations that are throwing off our old models. Why do you need the scanning tolerances to be so small? What are you trying to find? I just want to be sure. It's, it's not like we're doing much these days anyway. The glory days are over. Why not give ourselves a challenge before they write us off in the history books? Ah, uh, interesting. As requested, the atmosphere the atmospherics research team has done a full analysis of the data you provided us. The measurements of the Earth's magnus magnet sphere shows clear signs of fluctuation, often in correlation with the periods of frequent and large gravity wave spikes emanating from the moon. Astrophysics. Astro. Yeah, I said it right. You're right. Uh, the gravity waves seem to be affecting the magnetic shield provided by the Earth's inner core and may be affecting the core itself give to give the proximity of the source. The data indicates the change rate is increasing exponentially. Uh-oh. Wasn't there a movie about this called The Core? Okay. As the magnetic sphere falters, its ability to protect us from the sun's solar wind falters beyond the devastating effects of solar radiation. This will lead to something more dire. The core, yeah, yeah. The sputtering uh, and, or stripping away of our atmosphere. This has happened before to Mars. <gasps> the planet studied since the earliest days of Earth of space to see the Earth's possible future. We were afraid this future may be closer than we ever thought imaginable. Some 
Some may view this data as normal. There has been some historical fluctuations of polarity change at Earth's core, but in the orders of magnitude greater, we see echoes of echoes, not echoes, echoes of previous generations debate over global warming. And we want the science here to be clear. Like waves in the ocean, the gravity waves rise and eventually crash into the shore of the earth with devastating consequences. Way to go, Luke. I know what I'm seeing, Victor. The data coming back from the satellites is very clear. It's the craft drives. All those jumps from the moon. At this rate, Earth's atmosphere is going to start sputtering out into space. Uh -huh. Can the drives be fixed? I'm working on some designs that should discreetly solve the problem under the guise of an emergency update to the fueling pumps. We're talking about the end of Earth, and you're trying to be subtle about it. Huh. Judith, the last thing we need is people losing faith in grab drive technology. That might be our only option. To what? Are you seriously saying we should abandon Earth? The timeline is under 50 years. A blink of an eye for a planet. But more than enough time for a human exodus. Whoa. And what do we tell people? We say it's an act of God. One that science has found a solution for. Time for humanity to take its place in the stars. You know, didn't you? You lied to me. Yep. I... All this time. I dedicated my life to this discovery, Victor. And you knew we were going to kill off our planet? You haven't seen the future I've seen. There's an infinite expanse of promise out there. A meteor could have hit Earth. A plague, another world war. Colonized Zombie apocalypse. Galaxy secures humanity's future for all coming generations, across all time. At the expense of our home. Stop it, both of you. All that matters is building enough ships to get everyone off this planet. And we need to start now. I'll draft up a statement. We'll need to address the entire international community. I'm sorry, Judith. I don't think he is. There isn't a planet in this universe that will be far enough away from you, Victor. <laughs> we are never speaking again after this is over. Victor's a pig. Oh, wait a minute. My name is Dr. Victor Isa. And if you're listening to this, then you probably already know the truth. I was young when I first headed the retrieval team of an odd gravitational anomaly on Mars. But I kept what really happened that day hidden from everyone except one other person. Uh -huh. Even she didn't believe me at first. But I have no reason to lie to anyone now, so I... I hope you'll accept this confession, whoever you are. Oh, I'm Andy. When I touched the anomaly, I experienced 12 days of lost time. I met myself. He told me everything that has since come true. The grav drive equations, the tests on the moon, Earth's atmosphere sputtering away because of what we had done. But he also told me about a city thriving on a planet orbiting a distant star. Human culture, art, music, lifestyles evolving and shining brightly across all of space. What price would I be willing to pay for that future? Maybe you don't believe me. Maybe Judith was right and I'm just a coward who yeah. wanted to believe his mistakes were justified. But everyone has forgotten about the real origins of the grav drive. This artifact from Mars. Yeah. I hope you make better use of it than I did. Oh, I don't know. I'm... I'm... Please be careful whenever running power through the prototype. Secure all loose objects. Okay. All right. So it wasn't just a fluke? A oh. terrible but inevitable disaster? Yep. The crab drives? How did we not realize? Well, someone knew. 
All right, so, oops. Release the artifact, okay. Here we go. So it was, it was because of the artifact that we can do faster than light travel. Oh. Hey, DJ, how the heck are you doing? Okay, can I not get into there from here? No? All right. Is there an up? Aren't stairs? Uh. Oh, jeez. Uh, I don't want to die. All right. Um. It did. That's what, I, that's what I'm gathering here. All right. Uh, no, nope. that way. All right. Here we go. Finally. Whoa. Oh, hey, look at there. Destination. We've arrived on the surface of Earth. Uh, we need to discuss what you found. And it looks like other Starborn got here before us. Yeah. So, you might have company. Alright, whatever. Hang on. Don't you forget it. I see him. I see you. I see you. Dang it. Use those quantum essence things. Oh, R? Okay. I got each eyeballs. Before I picked up a bunch of those. Is there another way out? Oh, there. Is that, oh, wait. No, that's not them. Oh. Never mind. Dude. Hang on, let's check out the assault rifle. Oh, it's an AK-47. Or yeah, that's the same gun from Fallout 4. Shattering, break through even the toughest armor. I have some ammo for it. The tape is different, you think? You think that's a different okay. Well, I'm gonna use it. Hey, um, 
take that. Ouch. Where am I going? Oh, I see him. Am I going this way or this way? Um. This way. That way. Right. I mean, you never know what you find. It's like I've been here. He's upstairs with a really nice rifle. There's two of them, actually. I see you. And I see you. That's not any good. Do you think the bigger the container, the more security? But no, no, no. All right. Um, let's do this again. Ah, sorry. All right, not the best. That one's a tough one. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Sorry. Dude, let me reload. I totally waste you. If I do R, that does not work. It says R. Oh, do I have to do it from here? That's inconvenient. Oh, oh, I see. Oh, I see. It's like a, it's like a stem. I got it. Yeah, they are. Magazines, yeah. Talk to the emissary. All right. Whoa. You guys' ships look exactly the same. How do you guys know? In a parking lot, which ship is yours? Just, just wondering. All right. Do you understand now why I asked you to come here? The artifacts unlocked the secret of interstellar travel. I knew. At the I knew. cost of Earth. Yes, yes. An easy trade, honestly. Why have one world when you can have all the settled systems? Wow. Um. 
Now I understand what I found. I agree humanity's destinies was the stars anyways. But at the sacrifice of, of our planet though? Yeah. If Earth was a small price, I have to question your ability to assess value of any kind. Assuming we weren't going to lose it anyway. War, disease, famine, all the classics. Don't you see? The power of the artifact forced humanity to the stars. They didn't get to make a choice. It's true. How many would have chosen Earth? What gave Victor Iza the right to choose for them? You see the hypocrisy in what the emissary is saying, right? Yes, yes. They don't want to rob people of their free will, but then they steal the artifacts for themselves. In the wrong hands, the power of the artifacts can make anyone a tyrant. True. That's why we watch power. over them. Absolutely. The only thing you know. you're watching out for is yourself. The emissary is right. The artifacts need to be in the right hands. The hunter is right. The the only real rule is who gets all their artifacts first we're both wrong it's time someone other than the starborn made a decision Ooh, i'm going that route because yeah yes perfect all of that in a recursive loop forever thank you very much don't be a fool the emissary and i may have our differences but you do not want to give us a common enemy what you mean me for once, he's right. Don't do this. We can collect the final pieces together. Oh, I've been doing all the work. I'm siding with the emissary. I kind of was. I, uh, an alliance with the hunter seems like the winning strategy. I'm tired of both of you. I'll get the unity for my own. Hmm. 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 So do I make an enemy of the emissary or do I make an embassy of the hunter or both? <laughs> you know, it's kind of like in Babylon five, right? There was the, the, um, the shadow and the, um, the Vorlons, right? And, uh, they were the last two old races and we're the new one, right? So I don't think I need you guys. I'm doing this my own. I'm gonna make a mistake here, I know I am. Good choice. Thanks. Of course you realize they'll team up against us, but at least we're in charge of the path before us. Yep, I know. Well, look at that. The emissary just became my new best friend. Uh -oh. You've made your choice. When you're ready, the hunter and I will be at the buried temple. That's where we'll settle things. Oh. Meaning we'll kill you. But hey, at least we'll wait. <sighs> the final round doesn't start until there's only one artifact left to gather. And if I'm not mistaken, Constellation has one or two to go. Can I have a ride? Jerks. Well, this, this sucks. <laughs> I, I have tried several times to steal. Oh, look at that friendly little guy. Um, all right, let's get up for a sec. <clears throat> and, um, let's do this and do that and go there and answer all that stuff. All right. So the question is, you can only steal ships that are neutral or enemy friendly disallows crew. So I have maxed out my ballistics. Okay. But the question is that's ballistic. That's, oh, oh yeah. That's ballistic. 
That's ballistic. That is not ballistic. Or is it? This uses whatever MI rounds are. Are those magnetic rail rounds or something? It's a pistol. So does this follow underneath my pistol skills? I think it does. All right, so I think I want to increase my health. And I'm not using a whole lot of lasers anymore. That seems, well, I gotta heal more though. All right. Well, we're gonna fight on a planet. So. We'll use that last one later. Let's see if there's anything I can do to this. Um. that, not that, not that. There it is. Mutineer. So, I like the magnetic rails. I can do, I don't have any adhesive. That That is the duct tape of this game. <laughs> Depleted rounds. I think I want to stick with the deplete them. I like, I like what that does. And the, yeah, I could do it. I, hey, Kag, what's up? All right, so, um, let's check out some research here. I don't think. I'm a little stumped that you can't break down things like duct tape or adhesive. You, you would think so, yeah. But uh, g given um, the history of all the modding, once they, you know, bring out the GEC and whatnot, I, I would imagine making duct tape or some sort of adhesive will be applicable. Um, I'm still using my old CPU. So I have a seven, eight year old CPU, but uh, Alex last year, actually, hang on. Uh, for my Christmas birthday present, she got me a, uh, a 3080. When did I get it? Uh, almost two years ago now. So I've been very happy with it. Hello, in this video. Oh, I'll sorry. Oh God. I, oh no! Stop! Stop! Alcohol. Jesus. <clears throat> she's playing. She's playing. Let me tell you guys. Alex was having a lot of crashes. She was getting a little discouraged, and then she finally took it upon herself to upgrade her graphic driver. She's on a 1080 <clears throat> GTX. And um, with an optimization mod, I'm running the game just fine. Oh, I got you. She, ever since upgrading her graphic driver, crashes have been pretty much non-existent. She gets an occasional stutter, but um, for the most part, upgrading the latest graphic driver helped a lot. <clears throat> which, uh, which mod is that, uh, Mana? Oh, did he? All right. He's the guy that went after Linus too, which, you know, thought they were friends.
Uh, let's see here. So you did the optimization mod. I saw that, but since I haven't been having problems, I, I didn't do it. The Starfield performance optimizations. That one. <clears throat> All right, <clears throat> I will uh, look at both of those. Uh, there we go. Oh. All right, let's take off. Leaving Earth. Uh, I've, I've upgraded a little bit. Oh. All right, so we want to complete the final glimpse. Return to Lodge. Gonna be a lot of talking going on here. Banna, would you be so kind to post in Discord in the Starfield one which one you did? I would appreciate it, Mana. Just type in exclamation point discord unless you're already on the score of the impressive architecture of new atlantis right i've been here hundreds of times and it never ceases to amaze me all right um hopefully this still works there we go oh geez there we go there we go Places a delightful relic tangled up with hope, grit, and science. I gotta talk to Vladimir. Oh, wait, I'm locating more temples, actually, it looks like. All right. You have to go and do the rolls. Uh, enable Starfield roll so it opens up that for you. If uh, you go to get rolls here, and then there's a interested in Starfield, and you click the little star. Oh, geez. Hey, I've been talking with the others, and I'd like to get everyone together to say goodbye. Why? You know. Oh, I'm sorry. Sarah. Yes, of course. Yes. Uh, I'll be there, I promise. Thank you. It wouldn't be the same without you there. Oh, thanks. I'll have everything set up in a few days. All right, Noel. Mateo told us about your pilgrim's voyage. Thanks. You found it, didn't you? I did. The meaning of unity. Yeah, that was uh, center of the multiverse. We're building, yeah, yes. No, I'm not going to say the third one. No, 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 no. Wait, say that again? Yep. Multiple universes? It's like the multiverse in you the DC Comics and, mul and Marvel, yeah. Hate to be the responsible one, but the big bombshell of what we're actually building here might need another second to sink in. Want to go over this whole multiple universe thing for everyone? Yes, I wouldn't mind a little more detail. Oh, there's going to be a lot of talking. Metaverge Sarah, she told me Unity creates a starboard. No, apparently there are other universes. I died, Sarah lived, and she, oh geez. Trust me, the multiverses, there's multiverses. The Unity is how to get there. Uh, I'm gonna be so vague. Thank you, Mana. Explains why the Starborn want the artifacts so bad. Yep. Get them all and you've got a gateway to infinity. Yep. 
I don't even want to think about the physiological changes no, you'd no, need no. to travel between universes. Plus what it would do to the mind? Enlightenment? Or oblivion? Like the hunter. You have the opportunity to reach the closest thing to your god that might exist. And you're second-guessing it? One doesn't approach the afterlife without some trepidation. It's true. All right. This is our mission. Go into the unknown. Think of what awaits us. A new life, new powers. No, no. We should all take a think. No, well, it, yeah, it's, it's our mission. You're right. We have to see the unity for ourselves. You know it. Now, once everyone's head stops spinning from all of this, we can get back to work. Yes. Uh, not to make a sharp turn in a grand tale, but I got the eye fixed up. Bruised, but still blinking. <laughs> Let me know when you're ready to follow up on what it's seen. Yeah, 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 let's do that. All right, let's talk to Vladimir again. These last glimpses from the eye are from the farthest fringes of known space. Could be the only remaining pieces outside the hands of the Starborn. They already said there's two or three left, right? They, uh, okay, I'll follow up on them. Catch a smile out there. You need a ship with a range of 21 to reach your destination. Grab ship range is influenced by the grab drive. All right, I, all right. And, and your astrodynamic skills. Oh, 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 oh. All right, hey, dude. So that would be. So I'm taking, why am I still talking to Vladimir here? I think, wait for the service. Oh, 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 okay. Um, did he spot some more, where yet, yeah, dude? Dude, come here. Waiting for time's passage. All right. The eyes showing signs over another one of those big anomalies. Here, catch a smile. He always says that, it's so weird. All right. Um, so acquire is SETI. Obtain a ship with a grab. All right, so 21 light years. Let's, um, let's go see if I can do that to my ship or not. Constellation has suffered losses before. Although Robot has got no tack. So I'm guessing 21 light years is gonna be have a class C or because I only have a class B. So we want to do um, this, this, and itch. And it's weird how there's a new unknown. Ship, no, 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 new Atlantis. But I'll be honest with you, I don't know what my my light years is. I think it's like 19 or something. Alright. Where's the dude? There he is. Hey, anything I can help you with? Uh I wanna do that. Okay, no problem. Okay, no problem. And my ship can only jump 18 light years. So, what are the chances I can just do a very simple upgrade? To my grab engine, which is right. Oh, all right. So I have to do it myself then. All right. Oh, they're right there. All right. So, um, builder, there's my grab engine. So I want to. So I got the Vanguard Recon ground drive. So let's delete it and add, not a bay, not park, oh geez. I don't want that. All right, so looks like that's the best one I can get. 
which it doesn't tell me much. Max power 10, 18. So is that how far it can jump? Ooh. Well, that's all I can do. I can't do C's. See? I don't... Oh, wait. It's an A. So my question is where it says grab jump thrust 18. Is that how many light years? You need three skills in piloting to do, to run that. I, I can do a class B. There, all right, sweet. Really dark. Oh. No. Okay. Um, okay. Ammo. Good. 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 Okay. Hold low. All right. All right. So first of all, um, acquire the power there. I can go here. Wait for serve. Okay. Um, forgot which one they gave me. Final. Let's do this one, I guess. What? Huh? Really? All right. Oh, see, see if uh, the new driver helped. These suits separate us from certain peril. Such a thin gun, considering the weight riding. There it is. Aluminum? You are... Look very nice. Oh, I just took something. Oh, sap. I know where I'm going. Oh, uh, creatures. Pissed off something. Things, things are making hissing noises. This is where I'm gonna come out at. I gotta find the entrance though. Right here? Oh, there it is, found it. 
Gonna move. Bet you got some shin splints from that. I'm okay. Um, so I, hang on a sec here. No, that's not what I wanted. So that 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 is on six. Pieces are slowly coming together. Where is he? Jerk face. All right. Um, let's do this. This. that <sighs> hard to believe this little tin can protects us from certain why do i gotta talk to barrett i don't want to talk to him he's gonna go into a very sad story so all right Me too. I'll be honest with you. I gotta get out there and uh, cut up a big sheet of uh. Wait, is this really what? I'm confused. I thought I was originally trying to go there. Maybe it's Freya. All right, hang on. Let's do this one. Oh, okay. There we go. Wanted to talk to you about. Oh, I don't know. Go to Freya, something or other, something or other. Go to Freya 3. What? I'm so confused. Why does it keep doing this? Oh, I'm, I'm here, that's why. I'm fine. I know how to do this game. Not really. Bend in Cryo Lab? Really? Cool. Here we go. I'm not really 
doing any logic. I'm just finding things that fit and start slapping stuff together. Yeah. All right. I need to go refresh my beverage. So I need another 10 minutes. Sorry. Sorry, sorry. I need another 10 minute break. So bear with me for about, well, 10 minutes. And uh, I will be right back.
All right, I'm back. Um, I want to do something as soon as this is over. <laughs> so it seems like, and, and I don't know what happened. All right, I'll be honest with you. Uh, I would say about two weeks ago, there was a, actually, I want to get some facts here. So let me um, let this finish up here real quick. Do, 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 do. Cause it's really hard to test this stuff because A, I'm not that fluent with the bot. And um, I don't code anymore. And when I did, it was an ancient code, COBOL. Some people know what that is. <laughs> so what I wanna do, let me flip back over to this real quick. All right, so the problem that, it's not a problem by design the bot is doing what it's supposed to do. So it just gave a shout out to Brain. Brain, welcome, by the way. Um, and it's giving a shout out, I think. So let me let me get some facts here. So one sec. And I do apologize. What am I looking for? Here we go. So the latest release of streamer bot was 17 days ago, but I've only started having this problem about a week and it's not really a problem. It's just doing what it's not supposed to be doing. Well, it's doing what it's supposed to be doing, but not my version. So hang on a sec here. Let me, let me try something. I'm going to disable that one and enable that one, which, hang on a sec. So the trigger is exactly the same. Okay, so that's doing the exact same thing. So it's supposed to say, um,
All right, let's just go see if this does anything different. Okay. All right. So that's what we're going to do. And we'll do that. Do that. And we're here. Wait, no, we're leaving, right? Leaving? No, we're here. Your heck is slow. That's not good. So the sometimes I can get lucky enough and just spot the I think it's over there. Bending cryolab. Probably gonna get into a fight. That would be cool. Ouch. Oh, wait, is it really a, yeah, there's a structure. Oh, and a dude. All right, so I got some dudes I gotta take care of probably. Is that a dude? No, that's just a rock. Ooh, what's that? Well, this is interesting. Some storage containers just out in the middle of nowhere. Okay. There's a guy walking there. They're probably not friendly. Probably spacers or pirates or, you know, bad guys. light on usually night means power like an elevator oh no nope. all right there are many more freezing worlds than cozy ones you think we take care of the cozy ones more Coldy ones. Mm. I knew it. These guys are hard. They're tough. Dude, stop. Whoa. Got him. Oh, there's a couple more somewhere. Sorry, was it? Oh, yeah, line up. Oh, there, dude. Come on, come out in the doorway so I can shoot you. Okay, if you don't mind, I'm gonna search your buddy over here. Cause he's got ammo. It's a broken switch. Ow, 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 ow. That hurt like holy molasses. Hey, you're in there somewhere. I bet they don't even know they have an artifact. A holstered ground crew. All right, whatever. Hey, stranger. Yeah. Let's chat sometime, okay? Busy. He's over there somewhere. Hey, I see you. That was weird. What is, what is that? Is that just a tablet with some sort of a, oh, it is. Attention, eclectic personnel. We received viable intel on the location 
up another colony warrior facility, specifically a research lab. It's somewhere in the Narian system, possibly already occupied by pirates of the Crimson Fleet. As has already been communicated by Commander Creek, you have full authorization to claim the facility for ecliptic and appropriate anything deemed viable for our combat operations. If the base is, in fact, under the control of the Crimson Fleet or anyone else, Command grants full authorization to eliminate that threat using any means necessary. Captain Bales out. So, okay. Sweet, I guess. How do I get to this place? Oh, this way. All right. Gucci. All right. Underground facility. That means more bad guys. Oh, did I? All right. Right, let's go back and show. Oh, get out of my way, Grant. So there's a black chest outside with lights on it. Black chest outside, lights on. Not seeing this. Oh, here, do this. Take that, take that. Oh, that one. Oh, look at that. Ooh, contraband. Nope, not doing that. Nope, 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 nope. Not, not with this character. Thank you, though. I accidentally stole a ship. Not accidentally. I stole a ship. It had contraband. And I got in trouble. I was able to pay my way out of it. Hey, where are the bad guys? Oh. There are a lot, a lot of bad guys here. A lot. I have a feeling I'm going to need a lot more ammo. That's the way I came. I'm lost. Maintaining visual. Yeah, you do that. Okay. No? Seems obvious. Great. Whatever. do that i got that one too my mod list man uh, you should probably right there oh i just shot no one body here i don't need toxin I've been making ammo. Smoked salmon. Thanks. Yeah, I hear jetpacks. Interesting. Oh, wait. I don't want. 
want that weapon. There we go. I just took toxin. Oh, oh thought that was a digi pick. I'm gonna have to go around. So I get. guy gonna come in here and shoot me in the back uh hey shannon charlie wanted me to bring up the issues lab again for what it's worth i think we at least could do an evaluation our initial system setups <clears throat> don't account for the environment outside the lab you know rye won't let us do anything to fix it officially so we don't have anything solid we're all on our we're all on the same ship here um now that that's uh, out of the way. Want to grab a drink? Lars. Rise your lives in Project Marzana. Your request for additional resources to address the initial outline in previous requests has been reviewed. The decision has been made to deny those resources. Value risk. Got a serious problem. Jan, this is important. The issue with the cryo connectors in the lab and the ambient environment fluctuations we talked about. It's more serious than I originally thought. I think we'll need to halt the current experiments, pause the whole program, and upgrade the labs. Oh, they're not gonna like that. Um, my team has complete implementation of the SESCHAT, SESCHAT, SES, something encryption. All projects, all project data going forward is being encrypted automatically. Ooh, all right. Is there anything else? All right, so just communication. Where are you? I see you. I'm coming for you. Somehow. I need a diversion. You need a diversion? Uh, you want me to do a song and dance or something? Alright, so. I don't see how to get to that guy. Alright. Oh, there's someone up there shooting at me? I didn't even see that. Wait, you're it? Where you at, dude? Oh. You aren't ready for this, but oh. I am. Find anything worth selling or uh, using? Maybe. Exterminator. <laughs> cool. I need that. No. All right, need that too. Didn't think this through, huh? Would you shut up for a sec? Where you at? You can't shoot that guy. I don't know how to get to him. That door's all messed up. Please, I've done this a thousand times. What, fired through a window? Dope. Post-human? Hmm, the starborn considered human or alien. Wait, what? Are starborn considered a human or alien? Um... I think once you become starborn and you cross through the unity, I, I don't think you're, I think you're different. I don't, I guess I need sealant. All right. 
I mean, stat-wise. Well, oh, oh, I got you. Oh, I, ooh, I don't know. Thought you were going into story. Yeah, silly me. Ooh, did you pick? There's a door. An antiseptic calibrated star roamer. Is that a suit? Probably a suit. Oh, it's a helmet. Well, uh, it's got better airborne radiation. It's lighter. Uh, um, yeah. Hang on, let's check this whole area out. I see another door over there. Jeez. Well, their armor. Okay, hang on. Let's see if the other one I can open. Their armor's kind of cool, but not impervious to a uh, cryogen research lab key. I, I didn't find no key. We're gonna have to hack it. Hopefully I can get through this. Alrighty. All right, let's see here. That one works. That works there. That works there. Oh, oh, I did the wrong one. There we go. All right. Um, okay. Let's see here. Then we need, like, I don't think that one's not going to reach. That one doesn't work. That one works. Yeah, I'm still, I'm still grasp uh st struggling with this so two and a three. Oh. Huh. Ah. if i do that we have a one and one one that won't work i only have one one rotate that one Uh, four. Oh. It only works in one spot. <clears throat> oh, two. All right, so I was thinking about putting it there, but you're saying put it there. Oh, I see. Then maybe that one will work. Nice, thank you. I'm gonna put that one there and that one there. Thank you there, Mr. Brady, appreciate it. Um, see, that one work and then we have a single. I have a single, we have a winner. So these are two different doors that lead to two different places. Oh, no, all right. Are you kidding me? All right. Find the key right above? Right above where? On here? Hey! Not cool! Hey, I'm on fire! You 
before the door. Hang on. He's hiding behind us. Come on, get up. Get up, Sean can shoot you. Fine. Put me on fire. I know. Sure. I've got some time to kill. Hang on, I'm shooting him in the butt. You said the key was right above the door. I don't see it. I really don't know when you cryptic responses like that. All right, so. The ceiling. Body up. Oh, I see it. Got it. Well, I wouldn't have wouldn't have seen that in a million years. Thank you. But when you say the key is above the door, and then you say on the ceiling, and then body, I get it. Thank you. Oh, it was just a storeroom. And in my humble opinion, not worth it. <laughs> All deep core suit I'm getting a lot of suits well it's better physical not as good as energy better EM nice airborne very nice airborne O2 boosted so I think I can add well that's only an epic versus so I can add ballistic shielding I can do that uh, I'm going to keep my... I'm going to sell it. All right. Uh... What the? Oh, it's just me trying to get through the windshield, the, win the window there, which I don't seem to... 
Alright. Oh. Maybe this way? Maybe not this way. I don't know. No, I've been here. Yeah, I'm I'm lost. Been here. Alright, so hang on, let's see if we can get some help here. Does it go this way? I'm getting no help. Oh, okay. This way. This way. This way. If he says, listen, do you smell something? Oh, I didn't see this. Or maybe I did. No, I did not. That looks dangerous. Hello? It's Gamer Circle in Barrett. Anyone here? Ooh. Be cool, be cool. You, sir, are a jerk. Barrett, are you shooting people? Where are they at? Up there? Oh, okay. Wait, how do I get up there? Ugh. His pack blew up. I love that. I'm stuck. Hours now. Yep. Hey, um, when you're not busy. Yeah, well, I'm busy though, Garrett. Barrett, Jarrett, whatever your name is. Oh. Ouch. Alright. A lot of explosives. A lot of. Nothing. Okay, I guess we're going. Did I search? I didn't search down there. Oh. Uh, nice. Target reacquired. Yeah? Dispatch the enemy. Oh, there you are. Where are you hiding? Behind the. You're a chicken, aren't you? You're a scaredy cat. Oh, he had a hockey thing. Oh, maybe I already played that one. All right. There was a door to be opened in the other direction. Totally what's wrong with me. Hey Al, how you doing? You're finally awake with the Skyrim reference Wonderful Monday. Hey Al. Yeah, so I got a, a little bug with my bot that gives people that follow me and who have streamed shout outs. It didn't used to do that until about inside of a week ago. So something has changed somewhere. 
where I want to go? Um, I don't. I'm lost. Looks like another false alarm. Good. Okay. okay. There was a door I didn't open. Oh, it's right there. All right, so. Uh, Over here, over here. Come on, there you go. A little bit more jumpy, jumpy. And okay. Oh, I did go through that door. All right. There's a door. first. Uh, I don't wanna. I don't wanna? It's not gonna make me. Oh, wait a minute. Hang on. Sell that. A busted computer. Oh. Now that's where I want to go, but we got doors to open over here. Jesus out of me. That's right. I'm Robin, dead scientist. Think what you want. Not going to help anyone. Going for a better cause. I think. Oh, good. Yeah, yeah. Too many conversations. I know what you mean. All right. Okay. All right. So hang on. All right. I wouldn't be something if someone made RPG where people would look down at looting and disrespecting dead bodies. <laughs> Hang on. I got something for you. Where you at? There you are. Questions? No? Oh, nice shot. I was gonna hit him with a power. I'm 
I mean, the closest came like Fallout 3. Had a karma system and depending upon which way you're going good or bad um you know that that was not bad i i, I like that a lot so can can i actually do what it says from here oh okay so your ship doesn't have enough fuel oh wait so that means um Hey, you might want this. Why was my last message inappropriate? Did you get tagged? Uh, because you said fingers it. Got a moment? As in, you know, giving someone Let's the bird. I, you know, I, I wouldn't worry about it. I'm, I'm not holding it against you, but just in case someone, oh, that's a level 40 system. What is this? Oh, Sean, I've been to Cheyenne. Dude. Don't worry about it, Al. It's all good. The um the auto mod for the most part does a pretty good job, but sometimes, yes, weird things will get caught. And uh just my luck, I'll I'll let it happen and then someone uses it inappropriately and offends someone. So I usually leave Collective. Please maintain your current course while we scan your ship. All right. You you do what you need to do, sir. I'm on a mission here. Hopefully I can get there. That's all we need. You're clear for landing at Aquila City. Okie dokie. see oh okay so i can get to here now will i be able to get from there to there though and not get attacked by a bunch of stuff 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 get attacked by a bunch of stuff things stuff and oh so this week alex and i we, uh, we, we broke out the Fallout cookbook, and we're going to give Blanco Mac and Cheese a try. Because, why not? Please work. Oh, nice. Okay, so let's do... Let's do this. Let's do this. Do that. And what is this? I've never been here. Ooh, there's a mining outpost, a deserted relay station... And this is, can I scan? Okay, let's scan the planet. Okay. I am. Okay, cool. We're going there. Here we go. Investigate distress signal. Okay. Hey, Mayday. This is easy to... Explosion. High energy research lab. Massive damage. It's overrun. They're requesting emergency evac. Please. All right. It's the same thing. So, hang on. What do we got going on here? We have... Investigate the distress signal. But what about my other quest, though? Investigate. Complete entangled. Oh. <laughs> okay. All right. Uh, 
<clears throat> One sec. Um, so complete entangled. So we got to do that one. So go and land. Here we go. Research facility. Well, I don't have a whole lot of bullets, but I do have some bullets. That's good. Um, what I want to do, I'm do sorry. I, I got to do another little 10 minute break here, guys. So I will be right back again. And I do apologize again. Let me get, let me get, oh geez. Let me get this set up. About 10 minutes, that's all I need.
I'm back. Sorry about that. I do apologize. I uh, <laughs> I started drinking iced tea over the weekend, and wow, it's so good. But wow, that's a lot of trips to the restroom, though. Let me tell you. All right, let's uh, do this. Wow, wow, 133. You guys rock. A lot of smart people. Ding. I'm impressed. All right, let's get back to this and get back to this. And we're going to do this. <laughs> and we're going to do this. Life will almost certainly. You have time, of course. I don't want to talk to you. Oh. So, okay. I have to say, this has probably been one of the greenest. What are those things? Like, New Atlantic, that doesn't look good. I don't know. So what are we doing here? This is a distress signal. Uh, no. Investigate the distress signal. I picked up a facility artifact. No, okay. All right. Let's, uh, let's check it out. It seems like. You. Well, go ahead. I'm exploring all. Well, there's no un no one outside to say hello. That would have just brought me up here. All right. I'm from the constellation. I'm no, I don't want to do this. What? We haven't sent a distress signal. Nothing on the comms. No other ships in the system since our last supply drop. Luke, what are you trying to pull here? Oh. It said there was an explosion of high energy research. consortium isn't going to mess with you probably well yell if they do i guess 
The who? Consortium? Okay. Wait, what? Hang on. Enter. Something about retrieve something or other. So confused. Too many things coming across this retrieve waiting or. <laughs> so we want to do that. All right. Attention all. I am declaring a courtyard. What? All sections are now unlocked. Senior staff. Uh-huh. Right. Need to have a light bulb. Oh. Oh. So you're, you're Ethan. Ethan Hughes, Chief of Security. If you'll follow me, I'll show you to the director. I hate to say it, but it sounds like you're from Wakanda. Who's the director? What's with all the security? We're a small research station in the middle of nowhere. Pirates eat places like these for lunch. Ah. It is my job to make sure that we are not on the menu. Gotcha. Who's the director? Kaya Patel, our administrator and research director. 28 years in quantum particle physics. Or so I'm told. All right. It's beyond me. Gotcha. You're just the hired muscle. We'll take the back way home. Okay. All right. All right. Yeah. Okay. See our lovely storage area. Very. Don't touch anything. Very nice storage area. Nothing so, in that gun uh, case. Uh. Easy now. Must be. Okay. Whoa. Hey. Um. I pooped. That scared the bejesus out of me. Seriously. I don't want to be... The heck? What the? Easy, easy. What the hell was that? I don't know, you tell me. One minute, you're following me, and then you're just gone. Minute later, you pop in out of nowhere, looking like you were in the middle of a fight. I was. <clears throat> I was. Well, I'm not panicking or anything. But there's nothing here. I should have never let you inside. What is this? Some kind of stealth tick. Who are you working for? Dude. Attitude. If I had stealth tech, I wouldn't be arguing with you in the hallway. Um, this is ridiculous, I'm not lying. Look, I don't know what's going on. Let's get you to the director. Yeah. Maybe she can figure this out. Okay. Everything was real squishy and ugly. Oh, we're running. All right. This way. Oh, is this where I was? This is where I was. Oh. She was a skeleton. Coming. I know. Yeah. Huh? Who's there? Who the heck are you? Oh, oh, thank God. Finally, someone came. The distress signal. You picked up the distress signal, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I know. I wouldn't have made it much longer. It's been so long. I'm out of food, out of water, but I made it. I, wait, how did you get in here? I don't know. I really don't know. I think I'm shifting. Uh, I don't want Hughes, Ethan Hughes, Yep. but he's dead. Dude, we're in a different microverse. No. No, no, no. This doesn't make any sense. Yes, yes, yes. Unless 
I'm shifting. The accident. Should have said maybe, that. maybe this is a side effect of the accident. If the probe is still feeding power to the distortion, then. Slow down. Tell me about the accident. Yeah. Right. Sorry. Yeah, no problem. Three months ago, I was calibrating an experiment in our high energy research lab. There was an accident, an explosion. It caused a gas leak, sparked a fire. I was trapped in the control room. There was nothing I could do. Yeah. They're, they're all dead. Sorta. Yes. An artifact? You mean the metallic god? Okay. Yeah, we should. Wait, he's back. All right, we're on our way up. Fuse out. I was just filling in the director. Let's keep moving. Okay, so there's a dude here. If anything happens, the director's office is on the second floor, end of the hall. You can't miss it. Wait, where are we going? Like contains our promise from the journal posted to a 180 day rotation. The doctor was the doctor has loathed every hour spent treating headaches, paper cuts. Dr. Hughes, Mr. Hughes reported an emergency particle accelerator during team code blue full drama kit. So, this happened in the past. Okay. Oh, maybe I can show this tablet and it'll prove something. Oh, what does this stuff do? Her uh, companion affinity increased. Yeah, I keep falling into Baldur's Gate. I guess. All right. Um. I'm a pack. So. I see you. I have sealant. Don't you guys have something that would be considered adhesive? Okay. This way. Hang on a sec. I was down here. Now I'm up here. All right. I'm going to end up throwing up here real soon. Director. Thank you, Ethan. Oh, I want to tell you something. Come in. Kaya Patel, research director. And this is our chief scientist, Maria Hughes. You guys are related. Ethan said you disappeared. Oh, yeah, I'm... Right in front of him. Twice now? Three times? Director, you can't be taking this seriously. Oh, I'm doing it. Look, I don't know who you are or what you're doing here, but there has to be a rational explanation for all of this. Um... You found an artifact. You have no idea what you're dealing with. Can it already know about the experiment. I'm going to cut right to the chase here. An artifact? Oh. You mean the source of the distortion? No, we don't. Enlighten us. Uh, they're connected to a multiverse, countless realities. I've seen what they can do. Um, there's a, there's a key to the temples. Unity is, uh, it's... The multiverse? Other universes? Yep. You're right. This is well beyond anything we were prepared for. And you have some connection with them then. Interesting. I wonder if that's why this is only affecting you. I don't know. 
Uh, just tell me what we're doing here. Whatever this is, I keep shifting to another universe. That is quite a claim. What makes you think that? Tell us about this other universe. Oh, you guys are all toast. Uh, it's burned out. Raphael was the only survivor. Oh, there we go. Raphael? Raphael died in the accident. He... Wait, burned out? The leak. Director, there was a hydrogen leak right after the accident. It was contained in a minute or two. But if it hadn't been... It could well have caused an explosion. Another universe, though. That's a lot to swallow. No, no, it's good. I've been there. Um, is there some way to help him? You mean this other Raphael? Yep. No. How could we possibly do that? I don't know. Raphael was a colleague and a friend. If there was some way to help him, I would. But it does seem unlikely. Information. Um... We're not sure. Raphael was in the lab near the ventilation controls. He could have stopped it. Maybe he did, or died trying. Mm. Presumed dead. The research level has been locked down since the accident. I knew it! We still don't know exactly what happened. If he survived, he could have ended the lockdown. All right, tell me about the accident. This facility and the research level two kilometers beneath us were built to study a gravitational distortion. This artifact and the field it creates. All right. Three months ago, our chief engineer, Raphael, was calibrating an experimental That's what he said. probe when something went wrong. We still don't know what happened. There was a series of explosions and somehow it's still running. Really? Raphael said the probe was feeding power to the distortion. That would make sense. That's why the field strength keeps increasing. Mm -hmm. We have a control unit for the probe. After the accident, I tried to use it to shut down the system, but the kill switch isn't responding. And... We could shut it off manually, but the entire research level is locked down. We can't even get down there. I'm going down there. I don't care about any of this. I just, no, no, I, I, I locked down. You can't override the security system? Not from up here. The explosion fried the network circuits. Oh. Without physical access to the research level, there is little we can do. Sounds We've like I'm going down. in makeshift labs for months. Okay. How? I told you the research level's locked down. Look we can't get all high decibel on me. Uh, maybe I could do it from the other universe. Yes. What? Clever. Thanks. In this other universe, Raphael survived. Yep. He made it back from the lab. Yep. So clearly his elevator works. Yes. Take it. And you might be able to shut down the experiment. Okay. This is crazy. No, 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 no. But first, we have to do something about your shifting. Uh... I'm open to suggestions. Maria, do any of the other controls still work? Could we adjust the particle sampling rate or the beam voltage? You can't be serious. We have no idea what we're doing. This thing is already tampering with space time. If this gets any worse. It may also get worse if we do nothing. Right now, yes. this seems to be our only path forward. <sighs> All right, it's worth a try. Then it sounds like we have a plan. We have a plan. Now I'm gonna follow her the and I'm gonna start shifting again. Right this is gonna be door. fun. Hey, to say it, but I saw you outside this window and you were dead. What's that? Space rock. Um, what's in here? Oh, oh that's your bedroom. You got a, is that a magazine? No, that's just food. All right, hang on. I'm coming. Yeah, I knew it. Get to the lab. The sort of secreted resin. Um. Nope. Okay. Turn. 
So early after midnight, a series of explosions on high energy research have triggered a security lockdown. The brief release of hydrogen gas was detected. The air exchange system, along with particles, indicated major collapse, severe damage, and uh, lab facilities. Chief Security E. Hughes canceled the lockdown surface at 0430. Am I going to have to remember all these times? All right, so can't go that way. Need to go. Okay. I have been poisoned, I think. Something's going on here. Hang on. I'm going to do this and that. Prognosis. Nauseous. I need... Oh, I'm poisoned. All right. So I should have something in my inventory for this. Under aid. There it is. What's the difference between snake oil... Injector. Boosted injector sounds better. All right. There we go. Hey, Raphael. Oh, oh, what happened? You disappeared and the ceiling caved in and, and uh, I thought I'd finally lost it. Nope. Oh, uh, I met the director. We have to shut down the probe. What? How? I'm shifting. Look, if you think things are bad up here, the research level is even worse. Right. I barely made it out. That's awesome. And that was months ago. I don't understand any of this. <sighs> If I hadn't seen you disappear with my own eyes, I wouldn't have believed it. I... Okay, okay. You're my ticket out of here. Right. And do this your way. We can get out through the pantry. Here's the key. I'll back you up, I guess. All right. All right. One more bio break, guys. I'll be right back.
Whitey, I'm back. All right, let's cut to the chase. Let's get this uh, show on the road here. Sorry about that. Sorry to interrupt the game. I do apologize for that. All right. All right, uh, I gotta go pantry, huh? Last time I was here, I didn't have a whole lot of chance to look around because it was weird. You've got a spacesuit, a weapons bench. Oh, you have adhesive. Um, weapons, spacesuit. Um, um, so where is my shotgun? The long barrel, laser sight, reflex sight. Yeah, that's fine. Muzzle. I can do a tactical grip. But what does that help me over? I have a standard grip. Uh, a lighter grip to increase aim down, speed reload, and so, oh, I like I like that a lot. We're gonna do that. Nice. Okay. Magazine and battery. So right now we're doing this. Multiple razor edge rounds. A slice through unarmed. That's what we have. EM charge. Large magazine, increase the ammo capacity at the cost of aim shot. Hmm. I don't know. Extra large magazine. So. Wait a minute. So if, if we do this, our damage is 105 physical. If I go this, it goes down to 88.2. I get increased mag size. Um, okay, let's think about that. I would like to do, um, where's the receiver? So it's semi-automatic. All right, that's fine. That means I don't go through the ammo that, that much. Um, I don't want to lose the damage, so we're going to pass on that. All right, let's go to, um, see what we can do here. So this has got a drum. Is there anything bigger than a drum? Nope. I do like the drum and it's... Fully automatic, I like that. I do internal, what can I do? I can do a hair trigger, increases the fire rate. High powered, increases damage. High velocity. Oh, I can't do that. I can do a hair trigger. So, becomes lighter, increases the fire rate. A little less accurate, we're doing that. Where's my sniper at? Long barrel, medium scope, got a compensator. Can I do a suppressor? No. Not. All right. I guess we're done. And we're gonna go Let's go, let's go shock. All right, here we go, I guess. Well, it's a big one. Getting spammed. Not in this channel, you're not. Oh, 
What the? You... Security oh, breach! Go. Everybody go. out for it! Out of my way! Yes? What? This is great. Problem getting the old shotgun reloaded. I think I'm poisoned again. Food and drink are less effective. Fine. I don't use it, but I don't want to be poisoned. Dude. Look at this. It's going to take hours to clear this out. Assuming the rest of the building doesn't come down on top of us. That would be, that would be bad. Um. How should I know? You're the one who keeps winking in and out of existence. I'm not winking at you. I just want to get out of here. Go do whatever you're going to do. I'll see if I can clear a path to the door. What will happen when I shut down the probe? I'm not sure. It might stop whatever's happening to you. It's a reasonable theory, I guess. Okay. Um, where are the creatures coming from? They're a native species. We had an electric pulse field to keep them out. Oh. The fire took out the generators, damaged the foundation. They just keep coming. Yes, they do. All right. So I'm going. Uh, Ethan? What? I... Oh, it's you. Yeah. You realize you just popped into my locked office. So much for security protocols. Yeah. I'm trying to get to the fabrication lab. Uh, sure. Down the hall. Take the stairs next to the atrium. Yeah, let me get the doors for you. Thanks. And done. Is there anything else you need? Um, are there any scorpions native to the planet? Uh, yes. Kataxi. Nasty things. Tell me about it. The original survey team ran across them. You're welcome to read the old logs if you want. Yeah, I'll unlock the terminal for you. Thank you. I need, I need something to fight. Oh. Why do I have to persuade him? The Kataxi in the other universe. Aha. Uh -huh. Wow. I got an experimental thing one of the engineers put together. Ooh. But. But. Uh, but. Um. Maybe so. Okay. All right. Yeah. It's never been field tested. Sweet. Before, but all yours. Thank you. So what did I just get? Oh, it's another shotgun. Sweet. All right, thanks, dude. All right, so hang on. So I have a... There's my shotgun, I think. Yep, all right, so let's go back to the inventory. Compare to... What did he just give me? Extended mag calibrated shoddy. All right. So it does a little less damage, more. Ooh. So it's got an extended magazine, doubles. So are you. Wow. Oh. Why is it lighter? I kind of like mine a little bit better, though.
Yeah. But I wonder if I transfer those mods, the long barrel, the laser sight, the reflex sight, I wonder if this would get do 106. I don't know. I'm gonna go with mine. You had, oh, I can read some stuff here, right? Uh, archive, survey team. Established, don't be a fool of everything here. You have the apex predators, Katari, arboring carnivores with near impenetrable shells, deadly venom. All right. Okay, in the wild, ambush hunters digging extensive warrens. Okay, so there's going to be a big one of these coming up. I'm going to take that, 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 priminy. Ugh. I bet it doesn't have anything good in there, so I'm not even going to waste. And the moment I step through this door, I'm going to blink out or something again. I said to go through the atrium. Wait, what? Get to the lab. Right, I'm trying to do. I knew it. Oh! Things. Saw another one over here somewhere. There it is. So when I hear the squishy news, does that mean there's, they're around? Hey! Kick your butt. This doesn't look cool. So I'm only, I need grenades, I think. So I'm gonna get, got nine frag grenades, which do more damage than the shrapnel grenade. Hmm. Knew it. Oh, I didn't wanna do that. Hey! So they're underground. So the grenades aren't gonna do squat. Hey! Hey, okay. I just switched my scanner. I mean, how many med packs do I have? Eleven. Right. Actually, what was that? 
All right, we'll take that. I mean, do I think I need... Hey, hey Longfellow, how the heck are you doing? I don't know. A couple... 30 mil... I don't know. I just want to know... Okay. Son of a gun. Speak to Maria. I got my gun out because each time I phase... There's a bad guy that I got to shoot. And if you don't mind. What, did you get lost in the hallway? No. Well, it, it's actually having some sort of a, an episode. Anyone that follows me that has ever streamed will get a shout out. And it didn't used to do that about a week ago. So mm -hmm. I have to at least it's working last time i was given a shout out it seemed like to everyone uh i was locked in the other universe uh, right this is the probe control unit the heck is that most of these controls aren't responding i'm going to very carefully adjust the settings i can oh god there's You're... no way to tell what's about to happen mm. pay attention and be ready for anything i'm ready I'll begin by adjusting the energy feed of the electron beam array yeah whatever we're at 93 terabolts Calibrating to 95, 97, uh -huh. 100. Ugh, nothing. Yeah. Let's try the other way. Okay. 91, 89. What the? I don't know. What is that? Okay, okay. It looks safe to approach, but what in the world? Oh, okay. It's a micro distortion. Flux pattern matches the distortion in the lab. The setting is just exposing it somehow. Hang on a sec. Lady, I I'm I'm over Step into the distortion, please. Of, of course, yes. You first. <laughs> Hang on, I, I'm I'm encumbered, right? Yeah. I got too much junk, so um take all the toxin hey there's Linux guru gamer how you doing Linux so okay let's get rid of pill bottle I'm trying to get my my weight down here. None of this has got mass, does it? Uh, all right, let's go get rid of all the food. There we go. Have I added any new mods? Uh, um, no, I've just updated the mods. The, the one that I don't think I'm working right is like trash that you pick up that I just got rid of. You can make it unlootable. So that way you don't actually pick up something you never need. So yeah, that doesn't have any weight. Okay, well, let's get rid of the cryo mine. I'm trying to get my weight down. Almost there. That didn't help. Oh, oh, I forgot to sell all this stuff. Dog, gone. Um, value. Give her that one. We're right at our weight. There we go. All right. No longer encumbered. All right. Going in. Nothing. Don't say nothing. No. Hold on. There's a slight pattern change. Yeah, I'm taking my gun. Oh, I can't get my gun out. All right, stay there. Let me turn the feet back up for a moment. Whatever. Calibrating to 90, 91. If I die, I'm going to die.
Recalibrate distortion. Okay. Now what? What happened? Are you all right? Yeah. I, I'm just teleporting. It worked. It'll warn me. <laughs> so the lower setting causes the distortions to manifest and the higher causes you to shift. That seems promising. Sure. Keep it on the lower setting until you want to shift and you should be able to avoid any more accidents. I'd give you my control unit, but it looks like you already have one from the other universe. I certainly do. I'd love to take a look at that when this is all over. All right, all right, time to shut it down. Right. If you can get down to the research level, you need to make your way to the high energy research lab. Right. Disengage the power interlocks. Uh-huh. Then pull the emergency shutdown to yeah. stop the probe. Okay. That should finally put an end to all this. What was that middle part again? Oh, and before you go, yeah. the director wanted to speak with you. It really is just down the hall. <sighs> Don't you want to tell her about the little sparkly thing in your lab? All right, here we go. Maria, don't take any of my stuff, okay? Uh, okay. All right. Well then, all set? If you need supplies, I've asked Dr. Barakova to take care of you. It's the least I can do after everything we've put you through. Yeah. Before you go, there is one other thing we should discuss. Of course. If this experiment is the cause of your shifting, when you shut it down, the shifting will stop. Yep. What happens then? To you and to us? I don't know. You tell me. Exactly. And when you shut down the experiment, the probability function will collapse. You are the outside observer in the system. Whichever reality you are in, at that moment, is what will become real. For you, and your universe at least. The question is, which will you choose? I don't know. Um, I'm going to choose Raphael. His universe needs my help more. No, no, I'm going to choose... I, I got to finish my quest, so... I don't want to tell her. If this were a choice between my life and Raphael's, I would ask you to save him. But as the director of the station, I am responsible for the lives of my staff. 30 people. People with families, careers, futures ahead of them. Yeah, yeah, don't. In this universe. No pressure. You don't have to decide now. I won't. But when the time comes, please. Keep them in mind. All right. All now, right. it's time you are going. With the network offline, we can't shut down the security system of on course, the research of level, so you can expect some resistance. Be careful. Ethan, unlock the elevator lobby, please. Ma'am, research level is still locked down. I'm aware of that. I... All right. Done. Wait a Good minute. Good luck, dear. It's been a fascinating day. She said there's going to be some resistance, like mean robots and, and turrets and stuff. That's great. What's these medical supplies in it? Get additional supplies. Okay. Where would that be? Um, I guess there. Downstairs. Okay. Um. Ah, right, here we go. All right. Tatiana Barakova, station's doctor. This is not a public medical facility, but the director has ordered me to assist you nonetheless. I can spare a few med packs. Okay. Beyond that, I am not your therapist, your psychologist, or your cosmetologist. If there's anything else you need, ask. Um, here. My journal? Have you been in my quarters? No. Who do you think you are? 
The director may have given you run of this station, but I... Wait. Wait. What is this? This entry. It's mine, but... I didn't write this. And the scorch marks. God. Now you believe me? Yes. Yes, I do. I'm gonna take the I thing out of your buttocks. Oh, look at that. Yeah, now, now, break, now I'm your pal. All right. Um, all right. Have a nice day. Thank you, Doc. You have a nice day. Oh, oh okay. Okay. Yes, I'm going to an elevator. Hey, how's everyone doing? Howdy. Oh, howdy. Is this oh here it is okay oh all right Tesla pylon that sounds cool Yeah. I came across that one in grandma. Yeah. Get the lab. That looks dangerous. I want to I wanna look. It's probably the exit. I think. Use the elevator. I don't think. Did I just go in a circle? I think I did. All right, wait a minute. I just went in a circle. Uh. Okay. The security lockdown is active. Emergency override controls are available on designated security terminals. Yeah, this, this is weird. Override the facility controls. All right. Man, why didn't they give me all the locks I needed? Maybe. Maybe it's in a locker. Huh. You never know. Hey, a Christmas Carol. I already came across the, uh, um, let's say a black, oh, I thought it said black ops, um, Count of Monte Cristo. All right, well, I guess, um, I guess we're gonna hack it. Because, you know, if I could turn the security system off, that would be awesome. Nope, of course not. Nope. Nope. Um, all right, this one works there, and then it's a one. We got a couple ones. A lot of things to hack here. All right, this one, that one works. I can do an auto slot. Yeah, let's do that one. Because I'm terrible at this minigame. If I do that, then I have another single. Or... I do that. <laughs> that was easy. And let's see here. Do I have this to do that with a single? I like that. 
That is my last single. All right, I got luck. Oh no, see now I need a single. Oh, I got one single left. I didn't see that. I got it. I gotta go through another lock. Ouch. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, right. Total system failure. Stupid robots. Taking all your stuff, though. You guys come out of oh all right well bad camera I think I'm gonna kill all the security all right what do we got going on here I don't have any threes. That'll work. And then I have a single. Yep, gonna have to be. All right. If I do that, then I need those guys, maybe? Nice. Oh no, that one. All right, then what do we got here? Okay, and then that would require another single. Then this one, and then a single. Hey, there's a distortion in here. All right. I can't get through this because I have to travel through a distortion. Things broke. Oh wait. So if I do this, there it is. No, no, no. Uh, remote control. Disarm. Disarming. Disarm. Nice. All right. Um, security system. Okay, get to the lab. Nice. See here, I would like to update, recalibrate. Cool, thank you. And uh, robots, let's uh, update their friend or foe. Current user, thank you. I think I did that one already. All right, cool. 
Don't shoot me. Thank you. Shoot the bad aliens. Laser sight, suppressor, tactical stock. I want to try that. So, first of all, more damage. I have some rounds. A little slower. I'm giving this bad boy a try. Security lockdown is active. I know. Emergency override controls are available on designated security terminals. All right, wait a minute. So I got to go override look. What? I have to go in there somehow? I'm confused. All right. This ain't good. Oh, never mind. Hey, maybe this is not good. All right here, let's try this. No, I was too low level on that electro. I, I tried to, but they kept shooting me out of the water or space. Could have swore. All right, well, it looks like I gotta kill all these things. Come on. I am unable. Repair not possible. started. Oh, well, they got the stealth override mod, too. I didn't figure out what gun I was using before. It was another shotgun. Oh, this was not it, but I'm going to use it. Looks cool. Um, I got to go... Down there. I need to be inside there somehow. There's no distortion down here. Does that have to use one top side? There it is. Okay. 
Nice. Um. Stanium poison or something. Forge box, not gonna do it. I got a hammer. I know how to use it. Somehow, I don't want that. Take that. I have to get over there. What if I... Oh, well, take that. If I take that, that puts me in this room. So hopefully it won't be blocked. sure what I'm supposed to be doing. Override lockdown in the accelerator section. All right. Is there a window? Yeah, okay. Here's a window. And it's it's over there past all that stuff. All right. So this is like it's like playing with my squash. I don't like it. Okay, this door. Yes. All right. I hear ya. Oh. Hey. Have that. Yeah, I don't even know what to do. Stuck. I need to go down there. Can I scooch down there? Uh, no, so I need to use, so I'm in the, where are you? God, you guys are annoying. Oh, you're a big boy. Um, so if I could do this, Okay, I'm here. Where is the shutty down button? Down below? Is it? It's in there. That's awesome. I'm cramping? Why am I cramping? Is this still part of the, yeah, it sure is, sir. I gotta fix my cramping. Evidently I've got cramping. And I'm not cramping anymore. All right, so hang on. I need to get over there. In the other universe. I need a distortion right here, I think. No. Okay, so I need to somehow. Um, I don't know if this one's gonna. I don't think that one's going to help. 
Am I cramping because I'm poisoned or something? Hang on. Okay. Cramping, movement. Okay, so I need to get acute poisoning. <laughs> um, I'm going through a lot of aid here. So that solves poisoning. All right, so what does this one do? Now, see, I need to be... Well, that one didn't work. That one doesn't work. Oh, wait. Okay. Okay, now I need I need another there it is. Some sort of security lockdown. Holy shnikey. Mother pus bucket. That's a big turret, too. So, I... I'm stuck in this room until I go through again. I just hit K for some reason. I don't know why. I need to make my way to the high energy resource. Isn't that what I just did? Running out of ammo on that shotgun. Accelerator mainframe. Accelerator section. Override the lockdown. Oh. Oh. Fine. I have a lot of crashes when I transition back and forth. That's why I do... Uh, oh, right. Now I'm going to have a bunch of security droids on me. Oh, maybe not. Hang on a sec, I'm reloading. Oh, I see you. Uh, hang on, reloading. Thank you. Alright, so... Okay. 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 Jeez. Get to the lab. Am I not in a lab? Jeez. Pardon me. I know. Oh, oh, oh. I'm reloading. Good. Stand by while I search the area. Jerk. 
trying to save everyone. Don't appreciate it. So, all right. I need to go over there. Um, get to a lab that's on that side of the wall. down this hallway somehow. I'm at a loss. There's a hallway or a lab I need to get to. Flying blind here. Okay, let's see if I just if I do this. Nope, oh, that way's not there. Oh, source. Uh. You were on my side and I just killed you. You scared the bejesus out of me, dude. I'm, I'm really sorry about that.
Yeah, I, I don't, I don't see it. Scanner doesn't seem to want to help. Get to the lab. Um, is that the upstairs lab? Nope. Hmm. Somehow, I need to go through here. That door is still open in the other universe. Looks like it's down a level. I go down here. Through here. On this corner. Looks like it's like. See, all this structure is still going to be here. Even that's gonna be be there still. Yep, I'm at a loss. Get to the lab. The high energy lab. So is there any signs? It says energy lab. back to here I'm just I'm, I'm stabbing in the dark here I'm gonna have to well I oh no well, I tell you what, I guess we'll stop here. And I hate to say it, I might have to do a little internet researching to try to figure out where I'm supposed to go. I mean, oh, all right, have I done this one? Well, it's just this one part. Ew. Yeah. I mean, it's a great game, Longfellow, it really is. I'm just uh, kind of at a loss. Um, can't get a map. Look, I'm a robot. Um, Wait a minute. So this would be a good stopping point because I can't figure out what the heck to do. And I have to uh, try to rely on some uh, YouTube video to help or something like that. But let's roll some credits here. Do, 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 do. Chris Abbott, thanks for the resub. That was 25 months too as well. Thank you. All right, guys, I'm out of here. I'll see you guys tomorrow.